Magandang araw mga bata! Ako si Teacher Miley. Tutulungan ko kayo na basahin at intindihin ang inyong mga modules. Tara, basahin na natin! Grade 1 Mathematics Learning Activity Sheets Quarter 2, Week 3 Solving Word Problems Involving Addition after going through these learning activity sheets, you are expected to number one, solve one step problems, number two, follow the steps in solving word problems, and three, apply addition skills through problem solving. Discussion Let us solve this story problem. Joy and Fe picked tomatoes in their vegetable garden. Joy picked 12 tomatoes. And Fe picked seven. How many tomatoes did they pick in all? Read and understand the problem. So in solving the uh, in solving the problem, let us use the following steps. First, what is asked in the problem? Ibig sabihin ano ang tinatanong sa problem. Very good. The number of tomatoes in all. Kung ilan lahat ang mga tomatoes. Number two, what are the given? What are the given? Ito yung mga numbers na involve. 12 tomatoes and 7 tomatoes. Number three, what fundamental operation will you use? Ano ang gagawin kapag gusto mong pagsamahin ang mga tomatoes. Very good. Addition. Number four. What is the number sentence? Number sentence is the addition sentence. Twelve plus seven equals n. Meron siyang n dahil hindi pa natin alam kung ano ang sagot. Kaya, N ang ilalagay. Number 5. What is the answer? Dito na natin ilalagay kung ano ang sagot natin sa 12 plus 7. 12. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. 19 tomatoes. To apply the skill in addition or solve problems involving addition, we follow the steps. First one is read and understand the problem. Number two is look for what is asked. What is asked? Ano ang tanong? What is given? Ano yung mga numbers na involve? The fundamental operation? Ano ang gagamitin natin kung addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division? The number sentence, kung paano natin isusulat yung um, mga given. And answer. Five ang mga dapat nating tandaan. Lima. What is asked? What are the given? Number three, the fundamental operation. Kung addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. Number four, the number sentence. Laging tatandaan na N muna ang ilalagay dun sa sum o dun sa sagot dahil hindi pa natin alam kung ano ang sagot. And answer. Once again, what is asked? What are given? What, what is the fundamental operation to be used? What is the number sentence? And what is the answer? Activities. Activity number one, follow the steps and solve. Write your answers on a separate sheet of paper. Letter A. There are 19 red flowers and 24 yellow flowers in a vase. How many flowers in all? Number 1. What is asked in the problem? Anong lalagay natin pag what is asked? Tama! Tanong. Ano ang tinatanong sa kwento? Number of flowers in all. Very good. Number two, what are the given? Kapag sinabing given, anong ibig sabihin? Ito ang mga numbers na involved. 
19 red flowers and 24 yellow flowers. Number 3. What fundamental operation will you use? Addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division? Anong gagamitin kapag gusto mo pagsamahin lahat? Very good. Addition. Number 4. What is the number sentence? Dito na natin ilalagay kung paano natin isusulat yung problem. 19 plus 24 equals N. Very good. N munang lalagay dahil di pa natin alam ang sagot. And number 5. What is the answer? 19 plus 24. Let's add. Una natin gagawin is, a-add muna natin yung 9 at saka 4. 9 sa isip, 4 sa daliri, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 3, ilalagay yung 1 sa taas. Add natin yung tatlong numbers, 1 plus 1 plus 2. Very good. 4. What is the answer? 43 flowers. Activity number 2. Read and understand the problem, then answer the question below. Tino has 8 toy cars. His brother has 12 toy cars. How many toy cars do they have all together? Number 1. What is asked in the problem? Ano ang tanong? Number 2. What are they given? Yung mga numbers na involved. Number 3. What fundamental operation will you use? Addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. Number 4. What is the number sentence? And number 5. What is the answer? Activity number 3. Solve the problems. Number 1. Rika has 15 pesos. Her mother gave 8 pesos more. How much money does she have? Answer the given. Pag sinabing given, yung mga numbers na involved. What is asked? Ano ang tanong? And the solution. Kung paano mo in yung dalawang numbers. Number 2. Rico collects marbles. He has 26 marbles. Father gave him 35 more. How many marbles does he have now? What 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 are the given? Yung mga numbers na involved. What is asked? Ano ang tanong? And solution, paano mo inad yung dalawang numbers? Number 3. Lita has 6 dolls. Minda has 9 dolls. How many dolls do they have in all? Given yung mga numbers na involved. What is asked? Ano yung tanong? And solution. Number 4. There are 13 small balls and 12 big balls in a box. How many balls are there in all? Write the given. The numbers. What is asked? Tanong and solution. How did you solve? Or how, how will you solve? 13 plus 12. Number 5. There are 24 big horses and 18 small ones in the village. How many horses are there in all? Write the given. Numbers involved. What is asked? Ano ang tanong? And the solution. Activity number 4. Solve each problem. Follow the steps given. Number 1. Mona has 50 pesos. Father gave him 20 pesos more. How much money does Mona have now? You write the number sentence. 50 plus 20 equals end. And the solution. 50 plus 20 equals 70 pesos. Number 2. In a grade 1 class, there are 22 boys and 18 girls. How many pupils are there in all? You write the number sentence. And write the solution. Number 3. In a cabinet, there are 6 pants, 12 shirts, and 8 skirts. How many pieces of clothes are there? You write the number sentence and the solution. 
Number 4, Cora has 7 books. Lira has also 7 books. How many books do they have all together? You write the number sentence and the solution. Number 5, Mother bought 17 apples and 18 oranges. How many apples and oranges did she buy in all? Write the number sentence and the solution. Assessment. Write the letter of the correct answer. Number 1. Dick picked 24 gumamela flowers for Donna and 12 roses for Edna. How many flowers did he pick? What is asked in the problem? Yung tanong. A. Number of gumamela. B. Number of roses. C. Number of flowers. Number 2. Teresa read 6 pages of a book yesterday and 11 pages today. How many pages did Teresa re read all? What is the operation to be used? A. Subtraction B. Addition C. Multiplication Number 3. Ed saw baby animals in the farm. He saw 17 ducklings and 32 chicks. How many baby animals did Ed see? What is the number sentence? A. 17 plus 32 equals N. B. 32 minus 17 equals N. Or C. 17 plus 30 equals N. Number 4. J has 4 pencils. Dino gave him 7 more. How many pencils does J have? A. 11 pencils B. 12 pencils C. 13 pencils Number 5. Oka has 50 centavos His sister gave him 25 centavos more How much does Oka have? A. 65 cents B. 75 cents C. 85 cents Reflection. Read and solve There are 4 boys and 5 girls in a family how many children are there in the family? Number one, what is asked? Ano ang tanong? Number two, what are the given numbers? Number three, what will you do to find the answer or what operation will you use? Number four, what is the number sentence? And number five, what is the answer? Buhan nyo ba ang araling ito, mga bata? Sa susunod naman, ako ulit si Teacher Mindy. Paalam!